Welcome back to my channel. Do y'all remember this flat twist using the curls products? I'm going to use the same exact products to achieve a super defined wash and go. I've just washed my hair and sectioned it into five sections. Starting with this back section, apply the curls moisture complex. This will add softness to my hair in slip. So I like to apply this for that reason. Following, I'll add the hair gel, which is used for defining my curl. It has a lot of slip and you can brush it through afterwards to distribute it throughout all the curls. Usually you can't do that with a gel because gels are usually sticky or kind of hard quickly, um, but not this one. So I want my hair to be individually curled. So as you saw that once I brushed it through, my curls really clumped but I'm gonna use the shingling method to separate the curls into individual curls. And it looks like it takes a long time, but it's very quick. So grab for a curl, slide your fingers down the limit frizz and define it, twirl a little at the end to further encourage the curl. Here's the undefined section versus a defined section. I'm gonna go ahead and move on to this section, apply the moisture complex, apply the hair gel, and then brush the products through. Remember that once you've brushed it through, the hair will clump up. So to separate the curls, you go ahead and shingle the hair as we did with the first section. Finished up with the back, the hair is super coily, super defined. I'm gonna move on to the sides of my head, which is the quickest parts of my hair because they are the shortest. So very quickly, I'm going to do those sections and then move on to the front section at the top. Now for the top section, I do separate it into more sections because the hair is longer and it's also a much larger section than the other ones. But separate your hair into sections according to how your hair is styled or cut. Whatever makes your sections easiest. So I'm doing the same thing that I did in the back and side sections, just applying the products, brushing it through, and then shingling all over to define my hair even more and limit frizz. This is the finished wet product. The dry product looks completely different, so we'll wait on it. Hey y'all, I'm back. My hair is dry, shrunken up, but I'm gonna use the Curls Hair Serum to put on my hands just to limit frizz while I fluff and pick at my hair to give it some volume. If you have one and if you would like to, you could also use a pick. Just make sure you're fluffing only at the roots of your hair so you don't disrupt the curls at the end. This will make sure you just give volume from the root and not messing up the definition that you have all over your curls. Fluff it to your liking and you're done with this wash and go. Here is my finished product. I love this wash and go. I love the shape of it. I love the fluffiness of it, the definition. Give a like for it and subscribe to my channel if this was helpful. Also, make sure you click the link down below to see how you can get your curls products. And as always, thank you for watching.